First of all, Your Excellency, it's my honor to receive you here and your honorable delegation. It gives us a great pleasure and honor that on such an important day <coughs> you are here with us to celebrate the graduation of our elite officers. The officers that Afghanistan has waited for a long time to have. The officers that were trained very well through your kind support. France responded positively to my request almost two years ago. And then our other partners, brothers and sisters, came to help. The United States, Italy, Spain, and our other partners came to join hands and make sure that Afghanistan has that elite force. Today we are celebrating their graduation and it actually gives me the honor to say that we are responding to a legitimate need of Afghanistan that is to have a competent, accountable, and professional police force. This is a very, very important step towards achieving that objective. And second, that in this struggle, I'm not alone, that I have friends, colleagues, brothers and sisters just like you. And you will be with us, with the people of Afghanistan, and with the Afghan police force. I want to take this opportunity to thank all the kind and honorable instructors and trainers. And whether they are in the gendarmerie uniform, Karabinidi, or US Army, in whatever uniform that they are, <coughs> and they are in charge of training our police force, I want to take this opportunity to thank them very much and to pay my respect to all of them. I want to pay my respect to <coughs> France for supporting this initiative. I want to thank the United States and all our international partners for contributing to the achievement of our training mission. I want to congratulate every one of you who try to help Afghanistan by giving Afghanistan such a wonderful group of new leaders. I know your friendship and partnership extends well beyond the police cooperation. And for that reason, the people of Afghanistan are grateful to every one of you. I know these young men, and hopefully at a later stage, young women, we are hoping to have, are waiting very much to receive their certificates, to receive their diplomas. Let's make that possible and let's give them that honor. As I am honored to have them on our police force, 
so will be every other member of the police community. Again, thank you very much, our friends. We salute your commitment and we pay our respect to your friendship with us. Thank you very much. Mr.